Whenever you're stepping out on a new adventure, taking on a new project, you're going to get the question, why? And I've been getting that question a lot. Why did I want to do shoe reviews? Why did I want to do running sh gear reviews? Why did I think this world needed another YouTube channel? And these are all great questions. These are questions that, and I don't care if you're a YouTuber or taking on a new job or taking on a new type of race, the why is always important. Why did you get into this? And the answer for me is really simple. I got into this because I love running. I love shoes. I love talking about shoes. Ask my wife, I could talk her ear off about shoes night and day. And I also love, more importantly, the running gear. I love clothes, I love fashion. And when I'm able to combine two loves, running and clothes, that's like a perfect marriage to me. So I started off running like everybody else, a couple 5Ks, I did a half marathon, but I always told people I wasn't a real runner. I was just running to stay in shape. I was stay, you know, just running to keep the pounds off. Then the pandemic happened and we were all locked in. And I didn't know what to do. So I was like, well, I can't go to the gym. I don't have weights here. Let me start running. And I just started running every day because it was a relief for me. And it became a, a daily habit that I started to do. And it became something I generally started to love. When I was a kid, I played sports. I played baseball. I played soccer. And running was a punishment. And I always told people, that's my punishment. That's my punishment. But during the pandemic, it became my way out. It became my way to decompress it became something i truly started to love and then i went down a rabbit hole of all these youtube channels ginger runner believe in the run kafuzi you name it i started watching all of them i started consuming every of that and i loved the work they were doing and after a while of consuming it and started buying more running shoes and started doing my first marathon my first ultra marathon i decided yeah i want to get into this space because i think i have a voice that's a little bit different than everybody else. And their voices are amazing. And I love listening to them. I still chat with them, picking their brains. And I think these are the, some of the OGs in this space that I look up to. But I also thought I had an own voice. So I started doing one minute shoe reviews. Everything you need to know about a shoe in one minute. No glitz, no glam, just the facts. Something completely different than some of the other brands were doing. The other thing I decided to do was focus on a lot of running gear. Because like, like I said, I love running, but I love clothes. I love fashion. So I started making sure I did deep dives on some of the clothes I'm getting. Territory Running Company, Bandit Running, uh, Roman Run, Tracksmith is coming up, John G is coming up. I really wanted to make a spot for people to go, yes, I love running shoes, but you really need the running gear as well. You need the right shirts, you need the right tights, you need the right shorts. So I decided, you know, I saw some white spaces. Let me just jump into it. The other why is I love being creative. This is an outlet for me. I recommend to everybody, find an outlet, something you love, something you can jump into and really just be creative and let all of your juices just flow. So that was a long answer of why did I get into the space? It wasn't because I said, well, those people stink, I can do it better. No. It was more of like, I love this community that has been created. I would like to be a part of it. I'm a part of the running community, and I also want to be part of the YouTube shoe review, gear review community as well. So I hope you guys continue to follow me as I go down this journey, and I learn the ropes. It's not going to be perfect, but heck, we are going to have a lot of fun. So if you feel inclined, definitely subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, let's go on this journey together. Wait a minute, are you guys still here? You made it to the end of the video? Oh, come on now, better hit that subscribe button. You know you're gonna hit that like button.